It's the 2018 Chrysler Pacifica featuring this ridiculously complicated key fob. It has a 287 horsepower 3.6 liter V6 and this one is not happy. My feelings on the 3.6 are mixed, especially when it comes to the Wrangler. The 3.8 that came beforehand was more reliable, but it was incredibly underpowered. The 3.6 was a step in the right direction, but it was not the 4 liter inline 6 that we wanted back so desperately. I feel like the old 3.6 was a good engine until you turned it sideways in a caravan and put that restrictive exhaust on it. Then it would get hot on bank two and burn the valves out of it. They were also always tossing cam followers and chewing up camshaft, but I feel like it was a good start for the 3.6. Let's see how they improved it. I wish whoever owned this Pacifica beforehand would have changed the oil at least once, but this is the third version of the 3.6 liter Pentastar, and this is its $125 a piece intake cam follower. There's 12 of these by the way, and apparently they're less likely to fall out because they're more complicated. As you can see, they got a roller here, but that roller only contacts the camshaft in the unloaded side of the cam. Instead, it drags this section right here across the cam lobe, like some old timey ancient engine that doesn't have a roller on the camshaft. It's the 21st century, people. You should be able to put a roller on a cam follower without it falling out. Now, if you look up inside of the cam follower there, you can see on the lifter side, there's a little pin. That little pin actually slides out to put a bit more tension on this guy right here to keep it tight against the camshaft. That pin does exactly what the lifter is supposed to be and is doing. So you have two devices in line with each other, picking up the slack on exactly the same load. I'm sorry, I try to be nice, but that's stupid. The first thing I would have fixed is the oil filter adapter that's always leaking at the O-rings into the valley. They haven't changed this constantly cracking intake manifold either. This has been the same since pretty much day one. So the answer to the question, what did they do to improve it? They messed it up more. That's how they improved it. It is a nice van though.